Of those shooting victims were Allen University alumni, including Senator Clementa Pinckney. Tonight, the school hosted a vigil in Columbia to honor not only their lives, but all nine of those who were killed last week at Mother Emanuel Church in Charleston. Our Leah Holloway attended the service and has more. Tara, saying goodbye has not been easy for those who came out to this prayer vigil this afternoon. They came to Allen University to remember the nine victims who were gunned down in Charleston. Three of those victims, Senator Clementa Pickney, Dr. Daniel Lee Simmons Jr., and Tywanta Sanders, all alumni of Allen University. People are taking the time to pray during this trying time in South Carolina history. We're here just for world peace. We're here to bring unification of, the, of a people together. Saying farewell and remembering those nine victims killed in the Charleston shooting. Allen University faculty taking the time to come out and honor them by prayer. Three of the victims, alumni of the university. Wanza was a 2014 graduate, uh, had a lot of life, was a wonderful young man on the campus. Of course, we know about Senator Pinckney. Uh, has done so re remarkable work, uh, but also Reverend Simmons, a, a 67 graduate, was a pastor here in this state, did phenomenal work. You know, we're going we're gonna to miss them all. Many are shocked that Dylan Roof would come into a place of worship and kill innocent people who welcomed him with open arms. We have to put the past behind us and move on. Uh, hatred is, uh, is an evil. You know, and it drives us to do certain things, and we allow hatred sometimes to captivate our minds and our hearts. As they say farewell to those who are gone, prayers are sent for peace and love within the state of South Carolina. We really need to just band together as a people for unification, love. Uh, Reverend Clemente Pickney said it best, love, only love can conquer hate. So that's why we're here today. People plan on reflecting and remembering those whose lives were lost and standing together as one community during this time of mourning. Reporting from Allen University, Leah Holloway, Watch Fox News. And hundreds of people